A very good morning to all the students of class plus one B. Yes, beta. We are going to start new chapter, the Browning version. Still, students are joining. So, uh, the Browning version is actually a play. You can see I have written play. What is a play in which characters are there, which can be performed on stage when the chapter is written in the form of dialogues? Fine. You can see. Uh, that in this uh, page number 50 be better please keep your books i will be sharing the screen no doubt but please keep your books with you in in case you need to note down anything so uh, on page 50 there are you can see many characters i have written over there and dialogues are there and which can be performed on the stage so that is known as play so this chapter is written in the form of dialogues so this is considered as play fine so let me introduce the characters of this chapter fine Mr. Crocker Harris, you, you can see three characters I have written in capital letters and one character I have not used capital letters for, um, Millie Crocker Harris. Why? Because this is secondary character. Major character, uh, major characters are the ones I have written in capital letters. So Mr. Crocker Harris, he's the strict teacher, he's going to play the strict teacher. So this chapter is actually very, you can say, engaging and based on teacher taught relationship and what happens in the classrooms what happens in the school sometimes you will be able to relate yourself so quite interesting play if you miss a single lecture of this because it is a very lengthy chapter it will take time the whole week i guess so if you miss uh, one part you won't be able to understand what is happening here so please uh, be attentive throughout the chapter i can ask any one of you to uh, to check that you're listening or not fine so this chapter mainly, the, these are the four characters. Mr. Crocker Harris is the protagonist of this chapter. He is the main character, okay? Uh, he is the strict teacher and he teaches uh, Greek and Latin literature. You can say he's, you know, he's a teacher of classics, actually. Classics, you can say. So he teaches Greek and Latin literature, fine, that language. And Greek mythology, uh, what happened in, uh, you can say, the ancient culture of Greece, that kind of literature he teaches. Then we have next character, Mrs. Millie Crocker Harris. Mrs. Millie is wife of Crocker Harris. Though she's not a teacher, fine, she's not, uh, uh, you can say, part of that education system. But yes, her character is there. They have not mentioned any uh, you can say profession of that uh, character. They have not mentioned anything, but in the last of the chapter, in the end of the chapter, she will be coming. She has some important role to play. So that's why Millie Crocker Harris, but she's a secondary character, not the primary characters. Crocker Harris, Frank and Taplow. These characters are primary ones in this, okay? Then we have Frank. Frank is a science teacher. Fine, let me tell you about the age of uh, these teachers also. These two teachers are there in this chapter. Mr. Crocker Harris is middle-aged teacher. Fine. Middle-aged. And Frank is younger teacher. Clear? The science teacher, Mr. Frank, he is young. Fine. And Crocker Harris is middle-aged. Then we have another important character, Taplow. Taplow is also one of the protagonists. Uh, he is the teenage student. So as you know that this age is full of, uh, you can say, fluctuations physically, mentally, emotionally. So Taplow is also one young boy uh, who, uh, you know, will be, uh, but he proves himself to be wise enough at the end. In the beginning, he will also be committing some stupid mistakes. We'll get to know the way, you know, now you consider, now you relate yourself uh, that sometimes what happens when teacher is not there, you try to imitate the teacher, you know, you try to crack jokes, you have a particular teacher you like the most, you have a particular teacher and the teacher who points you out a lot, who scolds you a lot, who makes you stand in the class, who gives you punishment they you know these teachers you dislike the most you do not like them at all fine but the, you never understand that the the teacher who is pointing you out the more actually he's trying to make you uh, he wants your betterment in life so crocker harris is not at all liked by most of the students why because he's very strict he's very disciplined and he wants other also to be disciplined 
he wants others to complete their homework at time and you know whenever result days are there you know and everybody you know would wait for the last day then when they would get remove remove here means the kind of certificate they will get which is the actually uh, the sign that you are shifting to another uh, class uh, suppose you get certificate in grade 10 and then you move to plus 1 and plus 2 then you have the option to choose subjects of your own choice till 10th you have to re read the same subjects you know and in plus 1 you have the ability of so in that way frank is a teenage student who's going to complete his uh, session and after getting the remove in his term unki terminology mein usko remove bolte hain so after getting his remove he will be able to choose between language and science and other subjects fine so this is at this stage that young boy is fine frank and uh, he uh, also he student of proker harris right now because he has not uh, specialization of subjects right now so he has not completed his course or his session and that's why he is waiting for his remove and uh, the very next day is the result day clear and uh, then let me tell you about uh, mr crocker harris he is very strict very disciplinarian and he uh, you know never announces the result before official announcement so there were teachers like frank the young science teacher who would announce the results before the official announcements before uh, principal or headmaster had announced they would tell the student just to be in the good books of the students just to be you know famous among the students so but mr crocker harris does not fall in that category he does not like buttering he does not crack jokes in the class he is very uh, serious teacher fine so that kind of uh, uh, persona mr crocker harris is having and he will announce the result on the appointed day only clear then we have then we have taplo uh, frank now let's talk about this young teacher frank is you know he is very open minded he likes to be uh, friends with students he likes to converse with them a lot about their private lives and about other teachers gossiping um, about mr crocker harris trying to get information from taplo about how mr crocker harris manages the things in the class does he beat him or not and he even that young teacher tries to provoke this innocent young boy against mr crocker harris now will he be able to do so or not that i will not disclose okay so this chapter is all about let me tell you about the theme now okay these are the characters this is our theme or themes or based so more than that i will be discussing but firstly we will be reading about teacher taught relation basically in this chapter the browning version then we will be reading about limitations of education system also fine then feelings of uh, envy envy means jealousy feelings of envy among colleagues as i told you mr frank was jealous of mr crocker harris that how mr crocker harris is able to manage uh, able to scare the students without beating them you know there are some teachers who just even look at you and you are quite scared okay i cannot speak in the class of this teacher very you get scared by the looks only so mr crocker harris is one of them but he never he is not a sadist sadist means by giving pains to others he enjoys no he does not beat children he does not slap them does not use stick in the class but the way he manages the things is strict enough in a disciplined way fine so this chapter will talk about the feelings of envy among colleagues also clear so these are the points or themes let me share the screen yes beta is it visible to you all screen is visible so the browning version now nobody asked me one question uh why the 
title is named the Browning version. This word is not used anywhere in the chapter, the Browning. This word is not used anywhere. Yes. Can you have any idea about this? Let me tell you because you cannot guess it even in your dreams because this is not at all related in this. Actually, this play is the version of Jesse Abdekyo na that that movie is version of that English movie. This movie is the version of that Japanese movie. So they are, they have adapted from some other uh, country and then they make their own with their own subtitles sometimes sometimes within in their own language changes are made. Fine. So actually, there was a play, uh, a gammonon. Uh, it is a Greek play. I told you that Mr. Crocker Harris is a teacher who teaches, he's a classics teacher who teaches uh, about the, you can say, uh, ancient culture of uh, the Greek literature. Fine. So uh, the Browning version, actually Browning is the name of a writer. His full name is Robert Browning. Please write down on the chapter's title. The full name of this writer is Robert Browning. You can search on Google about this uh, writer. Uh, and he, you know, converted, he took hint from that uh, tragedy, Greek tragedy. You know, tragedy is when some ending is bad. Fine. You know that uh, genres of literature, tragedy is that genre in which ending is very sad. Fine. And uh, one tragedy, Greek tragedy was there, Agamemnon. And in that, uh, characters were there uh, by Achilles, was the writer of. Uh, so, uh, real writer is not Mr. Robert Browning. Achilles is the writer of that play, Agamemnon, in Greek literature. Okay. Uska version hai ye, Browning version. So, this is one extraction. It is not the whole play. Actually, the whole play tha about how the wife of uh, that main character, Crocker Harris, you know, cheats upon him how he becomes dejected at the end and all. So what tragedy was his life ki thi? about, uh, uh, you can say, a dishonest relation of husband-wife. So actually the theme of that play, Agamemnon was about that, okay? So in this play, the Browning version, this is, you can say, Robert Browning's version of Agamemnon. So he has changes in it. Just you see that they make changes in the movie of Hindi. Tamil mein koi movie dekhi, they like the idea. The script writer, uh, they change some ideas as per the Indian audience. So in that way, okay. So in this, they have concerned Browning version mein, they concentrated upon teachers and teacher taught relation. And this thing, the husband wife relation was secondary. But in that play, Gamanan, basic uh, concentration was on uh, honest relationship of, uh, you can say, husband and wife. Clear? Is that clear to you all? Kisi ko doubt hai, bita? Send me your thumbs up jaldi se. I'm checking those who are listening. Come on. All thumbs up. Yes, very good. Harnoor, are you there? Jacqueline, Japan, Jodhpreet. Jinnu ne thumbs up nahi kara, mein unke name le riyo. Jodhpreet is not there as usual. Harman is also not there. I can ask questions also. Thumbs up doesn't mean that you are listening. It means you might be thinking ki jab main I will do this. So this is very important because background is nowhere mentioned in this chapter. Fine, background is nowhere mentioned. You will not get even in other guides and all. If you think that we will read English from any other book. So please be vigilant about this thing. Actually, let's start. The Browning version is written by Terence Rattigan. Okay. So Browning version, Robert Browning's version of Agamemnon was other book. Terence Rattigan took some part and made a chapter out of this. Terence Rattigan, the writer of this chapter only. Clear? Uh, so there will be many expressions in this text like remove, slackers, uh, remove, I told you that certificate when you clear your term and you are having that remove in your hand, that certificate, which is a sign of that you can choose subjects of your own choice now, fine. 
then uh, kept in simple hai sadist sadist is the person who inflict pain upon others and he enjoys that dusro ko dukh deke khush hone wala that person is called sadist fine shriveled up means uh, you can say restricted like we say that the, he has shriveled up inside he does not open up about his life very introvert fine shriveled up usko keh dete hain then got carried away means i could not understand what is happening i got carried away emotions ke sath i i could say this maine ye bol diya maine ye kar diya i got carried away in that way okay then slackers are those people who are not at all interested in studying there are always many slackers in the class those who just come for the sake of passing the time i don't want to name the students who never attend the class offline never used to come in online mode also never respond in that way they they fall in the category of slackers fine then we have the word uh, uh, muck muck means uh, you can say uh, rubbish uh, nonsensical which does not make sense fine if i say this subject is like uh, muck to me i do not understand this mere upar se nikal jata hai mujhe nahi samajh mein aata in that way we use such words fine so i guess uh, cotton captain you know already so let's start this is an excerpt from the browning version fine so exactly this is not from the extraction from greek tragedy agamemnon the greek tragedy ka version nahi hai browning version is the book written by robert browning in which he has changed the version of real play agamemnon a browning version chapter ब्राउनिंग वर्जन में से ये चैप्टर उठाया गया एक्सट्रैक्शन रिटर्न बाय टेरेस रेटिंग फाइन दिस इज एन एक्सर्ट फ्रॉम द ब्राउनिंग वर्जन सी नीचे उन्होंने स्टार पे लिखा हुआ है द रेफरेंस विद इन द प्ले ऑफ रॉबर्ट ब्राउनिंग ट्रांसलेशन ऑफ ग्रीक ट्रेजिडी अगैमिन आपकी बुक के पेज नंबर फिफ्टी पे सबसे लास्ट में इफ इवन यू वॉन्ट टू रीड अबाउट दिस प्ले यू कैन सर्च ऑन गूगल एंड यू कैन रीड द थीम एंड करेक्टर्स ऑफ अगैमिन ऑल्सो इफ यू आर इंटरेस्टेड फाइन So this is an excerpt from the Browning version. The scene is set in a school. Frank is young, and Crocker Harris is middle-aged. Both are masters. Please underline both are masters in the school. Chaplow is a boy of sixteen who has come in to do extra work for Crocker Harris, but the latter has not yet arrived. Latter means जिसकी बात बाद में की गई है means Crocker Harris. They are saying in the beginning of the play. Now big play जब start होता है they set a scene. what is the scene scene is of uh, set uh, scene is of a school where frank is also young science teacher crocker harris is also middle aged greek you can say classics teacher who teaches classics then both are masters taplo is a teenager boy 16 year old and he has been called by mr crocker harris to do some extra work and uh, because you know Uh, taplo did not attend one of the classes of mr crocker harris so as the punishment mr crocker harris has called him to school fine but aap wo khud pahunche nahi hue wahan pe mr crocker harris has not reached there and frank finds taplo waiting and what happens over there taplo was sitting and waiting for mr crocker harris that middle aged teacher who has called him to do extra work on a holiday and it was not a working day in the school that day it was non working day and as the punishment he was called over there so what happens taplo was there and frank happens to meet him frank the science teacher the young science teacher he meets taplo and wo puchte hai okay now conversation starts any boy would like to read you can raise your hand because all the characters are male characters firstly that's why i am asking the boys and moreover they can participate by saying so yes raghav namanpri anybody interested in reading reading class mein nahi kari abhi kamne humne kabhi hai na so how will we do on the online mode not at all See, this this is the benefit of online class na no response at all so uh, in this play uh, let's start the conver conversation frank do i know you taplo no sir 
Frank, what's your name? Taplo. Taplo? No, I don't. You are not a scientist, I gather. So, this is the first ever conversation between Frank and Taplo. And Taplo is the student of Mr. Crocker Harris. He's not the student of that young science teacher, Frank. But Frank, Jan Booch ke baat karna start ho gaya Taplo. So, so he says, Do I know you? He says, No. He says, What's your name? He says, Taplo. You are not a scientist, I gather. Means, it come, it's come meaning hai, you have not opted science. That's why you don't know me. Right? Get this, sir, I have, I'm still in the lower fifth. I can't specialize until next time. I told you, jaysi aapke paas 10th hoti hai, you cannot choose your own subjects till class 10th. But after 10th, in plus one, you have the rights to choose commerce, arts, science, uh, medical, non-medical in that way. Similarly, when he says that I don't think so you are a science student, then he says, sir, I have not qualified for that yet. I'm still in the lower fifth. And by next term, I will be able to specialize. So I, uh, I have, if I have got my remove all right, fine. So I told you the meaning of remove. Uh, that if he gets his remove, if he gets his certificate, his result, only then by the uh, teacher who teaches him, only then he will be able to take admission uh, into the next level according to his own choice. He can choose the subjects now. Fine, he can specialize in one of the subjects. So he says, Ki, sir, if, if I will get my remove, then only I will be able to. So in a very innocent way, Taplo is discussing with Frank. Frank says, don't you know if you have got your remove? I told you one of the themes of this chapter is drawbacks and limitations of education system. So there are some uh, people always around us who will you know, provoke you without knowing you that you are being provoked. Fine. So he is, you know, teaching a wrong thing to a child. Actually, this young science teacher is teaching a wrong thing to Frank by asking and provoking him. Means, abhi officially result announced nahi hua tha. And they still have to wait. And what he's saying, don't you know if you have got your remove? Oh my God. Means, the teacher ne bataya hai nahi teacher ne. It means he might have told his students. Frank might have, you know, told his students unofficially before the, you can say, result declaration day. It means that, that he's not honest teacher. So, no, sir. Taplo says, Mr. Crocker Harris does not tell us the results like other masters. Like other masters. Please stress upon this. It means Mr. Crocker Harris is an exception. He is not into that category most of the teachers are telling their students results before uh, the, it is officially announced. Most of the teachers uh, are into this uh, practice, which is dishonest, fine. But he says, no, sir, Mr. Crocker Harris never tells results before official announcement. And Frank says, why not? Well, you know what he's like, sir. He says that, you know how to Fine. Now, we are on next page. Please open your books accordingly. So, you know what he's like, sir. What he's like means what sort of personality he is. He will never disclose result before official announcement. I believe there is a rule that form results should only be announced. Uh, I believe there is a rule that form results should only be announced by the headmaster on the last day of term. So Frank says that, okay, there is a rule that results should only be announced by headmasters. And uh, on the last day of the term, Taplo says, yes, but who else pays attention to it except Mr. Crocker Harris? Again, Taplo, that teenage boy, is pressing upon this thing that who else does this? Or to koi bhi nahi aise, uh, Mr. Crocker Harris ke jaise hai. Mr. Crocker Harris uh, does the announcement of result on the very last day of term when it is officially to be announced. But rest of the masters, they do tell their students about this result. Frank, I don't, I admit, but that's not criterion. So you have got to wait until tomorrow to know your fate, have you? So he is adding fuel into the fire. 
वो मिस्टर क्रॉकर हैरिस की अगेंस्ट ही इज यू नो फिलिंग अप द थिंग्स इन द माइंड ऑफ द यंग इनोसेंट बिकॉज टीन एज इज द एज यू कैन ईजिली बी प्रमोट ईजिली बी गेट कैरिड अवे विद द मोशन ऑफ अदर्स सो ही सीज मीन्स टू मोरो कल रिजल्ट है कल तक वेट करना पड़ेगा दैट वॉज अ संडे वेन ही वॉज कॉल्ड बाय मिस्टर क्रॉकर हैरिस you know is a kind of personality who would like to teach lessons to the students throughout the life you will not forget who praised you uh, sorry you will not remember in your life jab aap apne schooling kar jaoge you know you will pass out you will you will forget who praised you at what but you will never remember who gave you the punishment you will because this is the human psychology hame negative cheeze yaad rehti hain who scolded us usne mujhe aise bola tha usne mujhe aise kara tha So we remember such things, but why that a teacher did that to you? Because of them, you reached to that level. Had your teacher not scolded you at that time, had your teacher not stopped you from doing bad things in life, you your future might have been something else. Fine. So, आपके parents भी आपने देखा होगा आपको कितना डांटते हैं. Fine. Though you are not doing something bad, but they kept on scolding you. Okay. the result day pe after that you should do this about your routines about your calling to your friends going to friends houses so actually you are feeling suffocated my parents you know keep an eye on me all the time that see his parents her parents wo to kuch kehte nahi apne bacche ko wo to kehte hain ki whatever you you are doing is nice see how cool they are so this is the definition of uh, cool for you people firstly keep it in your mind if your parents are stopping you if they are asking you not to do something it is for your benefit only fine so that you do not get carried away in the wrong direction you do not mold yourself in wrong direction so similarly if teacher mr crocker harris is giving the punishment to the student he does not want to give things you know when we get things easily in our lives we do not have the importance usko lagta hai ki is bacche ne meri class miss ki and i will be telling him the very next day result wale din i will be telling him that you are passing then he will not learn a lesson firstly i will teach him a lesson that come to school on the holiday and do some extra work and then i will tell you your result so in that way he is teaching a discipline value so the next time he will not repeat in his life clear yes but who then i don't i admit he says that you know kal tak wait karna padega yes uh, supposing the answer is favorable what then see one thing is over now that clever teacher frank is changing his topic he saying if you get your remove then means which stream you are going to opt now this is what he wants wo kehta hai ki isko to science lena chahiye so he is going to attract that child towards his own stream and he is going to you know uh, say that languages are not better or other subjects are not better always so all subjects are equally important so he is going to keep his subject at the top most priority who frank now stopping here i would like to ask diljeet please unmute yourself tell me what do you learn about frank's character out of this friendly teacher friendly or is he disciplined no okay bell has gone so we will continue this discussion tomorrow please join well in time we will continue this play have a nice day